As we have seen the working of the load cell experiment in our previous video, now we will do the entire experiment. So please take down this table. Please pause this video and take down this table. This will be helpful while doing the experiment and its calculation. For the experiment, we will be only using the actual load and the indicated load in this tabular column. The error and the error percentage will be part of the calculation. Please note that the values of actual and indicated load are in kgs or kilogram. Now let's start the experiment. Switch on the power supply to the digital strain indicator. Please switch on the device for use. When you switch on the digital strain indicator, its reading should be zero. If it is not zero initially, then we have to set it to zero. We have to use the zero knob, turn it around until the strain indicator reading reaches zero. It should be something like this. The digital strain indicator has been set to 0.00 kilograms. We put 0.1 kgs or 100 grams of weight on the load cell and then calibrate the digital strain indicator to the first weight which we put. This is 0.1 kg of load placed on the load cell. Let's take down the first actual load value as 0.1 kilograms. We calibrate the digital strain indicator to the actual value of 0.1 kilograms by rotating the cal knob in the digital strain indicator. Let's rotate the cal knob to calibrate. The calibrated digital strain indicator reading will be taken in the indicated load column and then all the next reading of the digital strain indicator will be taken in this column too. The actual value is 0.2 kilograms as shown above 2 100 grams of weight are kept adding up to 200 grams. The indicated reading is 0.21 kilograms from the digital strain indicator. Now let us increase the pace of the video as we have understood on how to take the reading into the tabular column. Do copy the values alongside for better understanding of the next calculation videos of finding error and error percentage. The actual load is 0.3 kg and the indicated load is 0.31 kg. The actual load is 0.4 kg and the indicated load is 0.42 kg. The actual load is 0.5 kg and the indicated load is 0.52 kg. Please pause the video and take down this table, will be useful for the calculation videos. Let's see in the next video.